So this is the style I'll be making today. This health balm is very easy to make, simple. Within 45 minutes, you are done with it. So this time around, it's not the time to waste fabric. This time around, no wasting of fabric. So use any of your fabric to do something like this. You're going to love it. In fact, when I was making this style, this video, I joined the pieces. I joined it for me to get this style. Because I don't want to waste any of my fabric at all. I want to use my fabric to get something. Like this one, I joined it. So you can join your own and get something like this very easily. And in this video, I will be teaching you how I make this style step by step. In a way that we understand it very easy. It's very easy. Within 45 minutes, we are done with it. And guess what? Please, before watching this my video, just help me. Subscribe on this my channel. Subscribe. Like. So this is the fabric I'll be needing. I'll be needing three pieces of fabric on this uh, video. So this uh, this one is the main fabric. The length is 43. Yes, 43. The length of this one is 43. The length is 43. But you can use uh, 45. You can use 48. Depends how full, full you want it to be. But in this tutorial, I'll be using uh, 43 for the length of this one. And the wideness, the width is, I'll be, I'll be using uh, 8 inches. 8 inches for the wideness. Why the, the length is, the length is uh, 43. The length is 43. Why the wideness is 8 inches. So I'll be teaching this video step by step in a way that you will understand it. It's very, very easy to understand. So, like I said, I need to, uh, I'll be needing to the um, two pieces of fabric for it. This one is the one I'll be using. I'll be, I will use, um, I will put elastic on this one. Why this one is the inner lining? Yes, it's the inner lining. This is the inner lining. This one is for the elastic. So the elastic I'll be using is um, eight, seven inches. The elastic is seven inches. So the wideness of this, uh, the inner lining, the, the length of the inner lining is, the length is 15 inches. 15 inches for the length. Why the wideness is three inches. So, 15 inches for the length, 15 inches for the length, why the wideness of it is 3 inches. So the same thing with this, part of this uh, inner lining, 3, inch, three inches by 15 inches by 15 inches inches so i'm going to be starting it now like i said the elastic is seven inches seven inches seven inches don't cut more than that seven is okay the wideness of it is a uh, one inches so this particular the the main fabric i will be folding it into two like this i fold it into two like this I'll fold it all the way down. Look at how I fold it like this. And fold it again like this. See what I did here? I fold into two like this. And it's like this. And I take it from this upper side here. And bring it to this upside. And fold it like this. So you're gonna give me this form it's gonna be like this i folded it so see so what i'm going to do now make sure it's equal parts so i will use my my tape proof and measure don't measure from the folding side measure for this 
open side here you measure from up like this one and half inches yes one and half inches like this I measure one and half one and half take it to like this to seven inches to seven inches from here to here so I use my lula and make straight line just a straight line I'm going to be cutting it like this I'll cut it to this size. Before cut it, you make sure you use the pin to hold it to avoid shifting. I've hold, I've used pin to pin it. After that, I use the my scissors and cut it. So I've cut it. After that, I bring it to this side, remove the pin, see how it looks, see the shape. So I'm going to be sewing it like this, I will sew from this side, just one quarter, sew one quarter straight to this side. I will also sew this, uh, this elastic one here. Remember, this is uh, the length is uh, 15, while the wideness is 3. I said it again, the length of this, uh, the length is, uh, is 15. The length is 15, while the wideness is 3. So, I will take it to the machine now to go and sew it. Now fold it like this. Fold it into two like this. I will fold it into two and sew quarter inch. Remember, this is where the elastic will be passing. Remember, when you are sewing it, or you just sew just quarter because of the elastic. So this one is the inner line i'm not going to be putting elastic on this one this one is going to be inside the main fabric so i will take it to the machine now and make a stitch of it so i have sewed this here so i'm going to be turning it outside i've sewed the three the three pieces of the fabric so i will bring, I will bring it uh, out for you to see it can use your hand to do it. It's not it's not too tiny like that. You can use your scissors and bring it out. So I bring it out like this. You can even use your hand. So I bring it out. The same thing with this one. I'm going to bring it out. So I'm done with it. So I will take uh, one of this, uh, this one I cut 15 inches at length, I will take it, remember it's two, now is this one now uh, is for the inner lining, why this one is one that I will be passing my elastic to, so I've put my hook on this uh, elastic, I pass it like this, Like I said, it's not too hard, very easy. Within 45 minutes, you are done with this work. So I'm going to I'll take it to the machine now. I'll sew it like this, sew it like this to hold the elastic down. 
So I've passed the elastic inside, see how it is. After that, I sew it down and sew it this side. So make sure to let this uh, sewing be at the down part, as in let it be equal like this at the middle side, the center. Yes. So this one I'm going to be passing this one. This is the lining. The inside uh, the inner lining. I'm going to be putting it inside this uh, fabric here. So I will pass my hook like this. And like this. I'm going to be passing it again. Inside this uh, this the main fabric. I'm going to pass it. All the way going to pass it and bring it out from this side so remember i start passing it from this side this is the fabric i pass it through to this uh, side and bring it out so i bring it to this side look at how volume it is like I said, this is 43. If you want the volume to be big, very big, you can make it 48. You can even make it 50. Depend how big you want it to be. But if you want it like this, this one is a 43. It's okay like that. Depends your choice. Depends how you want it to be. It's very easy. Look at it. After that, uh, make sure that this sewing part will be at the at the center like this let it be at the back just like this see what i'm doing here very easy like i said make sure that this center turn it down like this going to be at the bottom side so this is how it is so i'm going to be passing this rubber at this side here So this is what I will do now. I will take this uh, rubber, this one that I, I put the elastic, um, take this one. This is the inner lining, the, the inner lining, the one I put inside this uh, main fabric. Um, I put it inside like this. It's gonna be like this. First, don't put this one yet. And that after that I will go to my machine now and sew this side the same thing I'll come to this side again and let me explain it very well I'm going to this side again here and put this side to this side and sew it don't sew this one I'm not sewing this one this is the one I'm sewing the inner lining and this one I put this one inside this one I use the elastic for. I put it inside this place. I make sure I enter inside. I take it to my machine and make a stitch on it. I remember I passed it through here before. It's going to be like this. So I'm taking it to my machine now to go and pull it down on this side and I'll come and show you. Secure, I've used the sewing machine to hold it down here and this other side. So I'm going to be using this uh, this one here. The fabric to cover the rough edge here. So this is what I will be I'm going to be doing now. Sorry for this. Oh, uh, make sure that the sewing, this sewing part here, going to meet with this particular one here. It's already there already. So I'm going to be for me to cover this rough edge here. I pull this up. Um, like I said, make sure that. These two join together, these two swaying parts. I fold half inches. That's it. Just fold it like this. Fold half inches like this. So it's going to be like this. 
So what I did here, let me repeat it again. This is the plate I saw. So I'm using this one to cover the rough edge. See what I did here? I turned this uh, this sewing piece with bits we joined together with this particular one, and I'm going to be folding half inch, half inches for this. Other side half inches. Cover the rough edge of this uh, elastic side. So this is the this is it now. So here you come to this side. So this uh, this excess here. See what you going to do. You fold it like this. To this side come to this side you fold this this side so this side it is now so it has covered the rough edge of this side you use your machine and make a stitch so it straight down look at how it is here see it here so it's done and so it's done so we're going to we're going to be doing it here I hope you understand what I did now. I fold half inches to cover the rough edge of this one. I fold half inch like this. Remember I said the sewing part at the bottom part, it will join together with this particular one. After folding this half, it's going to be like this. Mm -hmm. Just take it like this. See how it is. You fold it to the back side you take this side again you fold it again to the other back side and take it to the machine and sew it straight so when you turn turn the back side see how it looks sew it down so the same thing here i was going to be like i said i i said that i'll be teaching these tutorials this uh work step by step in a way that you understand it so like i said again the other side make sure that this sewing two part is together with this uh, elastic side and fold half inches i fold half inches again or oh, to this side fold it straight down fold it again like this so this is it Now this excess that remain that come out like this, after folding it, this excess that come out like this, what I'm you going to do is fold it down. This other side, you fold it to this side and make a sewing, straight sewing like this. I'm done with the sewing. I've uh, I've sewed it. Wait. and this is how it's come out thanks for watching please if you have not subscribed before watching this uh, video please help me to subscribe on this channel like this my video and share my video please give it a try and see how it will come out god bless you as you do so i love you bye bye thank you As uh, you can see the size, you can use it to go to church, you can use it for occasion. Like I said earlier, it's very easy to make. Um, give it a try and see how it comes out. Thank you for watching it. Please, if you know you have not subscribed before watching this video, please help me to subscribe on this channel. Like this my video and share this my video. God bless you as you do so. Thank you very much.